You have good days, you have bad days, but the main thing is to grow mentally. What's up guys, it's Grace from Pittsburgh Fit and I'm gonna be taking you through your Pit Fit workout for today. Our warm up, we're gonna start off two rounds, 30 seconds of up downs, 30 seconds of good mornings, and 30 seconds of pro retract push ups. So these up downs, you're gonna come down, you're gonna place your hands onto the ground, hinge at the hips, jump your feet back into that plank, and stand up nice and tall. Good, we're gonna be going through these for 30 seconds here before coming up into good mornings. So from here, we're gonna hinge at the hips, our back's gonna stay nice and flat, our chest comes down towards the ground, and stand on up, good. Keep a slight bend in those knees, warm up those hamstrings here. Our last 30 second interval we have is pro recheck push up So we're gonna come down into a plank position, keep those arms nice and straight. Our shoulder blades are gonna be doing all the work here, squeezing them down, and then pushing them up, good. Go through that one more time before getting into the second part of our warm up. We'll grab a barbell for this. We got two rounds, 10 clean deadlifts, 10 high hang high pulls, and 10 hang muscle cleans. All right, so these clean deadlifts, you're gonna have your hands in that clean grip position right outside of your hips. From here, you're gonna come down, hinge, bend down once you pass those knees. Your butt's gonna be down a little bit more than um, a traditional deadlift, all right? It's the starting position of our clean is what we're going for. Then you'll bring those knees back and stand on up, good. Notice she's keeping the bar nice and close the whole rep. That's what we're looking for there. From there, we're going into 10 high hang, high pulls. So we're gonna come into that high hang position. So just a little bend in those knees. This bar's gonna sit at your hips. You're gonna pull that bar up, lead with your elbows nice and tall, good. Pull up as high, you can, as high as you can, elbows lead the way there. From there, we're going into 10 hang muscle cleans. So we're gonna do that same dip. We're gonna come down to our knees. We're gonna bring that barbell up and come, you're gonna swipe those elbows through. Notice we're coming back into that high hang position that we were in previously, all right? So once we get there, we're doing that same exact high pull. We're just dropping with our elbows this time. All right, we'll go through that one more time before getting into our strength. All right, that's gonna take us into our strength for today. We're doing four working sets here. Our rep schemes are gonna be six, four, four, two. Our goal is to build to a heavy weight here. So power clean. We're gonna be starting from the floor. So we're combining this clean deadlift with everything else we did earlier. So it starts from the floor. You're gonna pull your knees back. That bar stays nice and close. Then that's gonna come all the way up to your hips. Once you get to your hips, you're gonna do that high pull like before, jump and extend, good. All right, we wanna make sure we're catching with those elbows up nice and tall, all right? If we don't let those elbows come through, that bar might fall forward and that is not what we're looking for. So you go for six, then you're gonna go for a set of four, another set of four, and finally a set of two. All right, don't be afraid to go heavy today for those two reps. That's gonna take us into our workout, all right? We have a benchmark, Elizabeth-ish, all right? <laughs> For time, 18, 15, 12, 9 of hang power cleans and hand release push ups. So we've done a bunch of power cleans now, we're all warmed up, all right? These ones will not be from the floor, we're coming from the hang position, so right above that knee. All right, so dip, good, start from the knee, jump up, just like before, we're finishing in that same exact way. High pull, elbows come through. Good. Once you finish 18 reps of those, you go into hand release push-ups. So you're gonna come down onto the floor into that plank position. Drop your chest to the floor, lift those hands up and press up, good. All right, try not to use your legs or anything, any of your lower body, we're really trying to isolate those triceps here to get the most out of it. So once again, you'll have 18 hang power cleans, 18 hand release push-ups, 15, 15, 12, 12, nine, nine. All right, that's gonna be for time. As soon as you finish that, you call it a day. But we have a finisher for you, all right? That wasn't enough. We have a six minute EMOM. 25 seconds of an overhead plate reverse lunge plus a 25 second gun hold, all right? So this overhead plate reverse lunge, exactly like it sounds, you're gonna extend those arms forward, that plate's gonna be over your head, you're gonna step back, reverse lunge, and good, stand up. Notice, her chest is up nice and tall, all right? The whole time, we're not dropping forward here. All right, we want that good posture. I should be able to read whatever is on her shirt the entire time. 25 seconds, go, all right? And then you will go into a 25 second gun hold. So you're gonna bring that plate up, good, right by your side. Yeah, holding it at that 90 degree angle, drop it down a little tiny bit, good. Hold it 90 degrees, um, 
get a nice bicep pump there. If that's too easy or you really want to go for it, we can go for 30 seconds of each of those and get no rest in that six minutes. So you're feeling good, let's go for that, all right? Let us know how you like that finisher in the comments below and have a great rest of your day.